I don't know how many of you remember The Last Temptation of Christ, which uh, was a Martin Scorsese film from 1987. And uh, when I was an undergraduate in Oxford, when this film came out, and I remember various members of the Christian Union picketed the cinema where it was being shown. It was a controversial film because it has a scene in which Jesus is depicted having sex with Mary Magdalene, about more of which anon. But I remember going up to the cinema and uh, one of my friends was there and uh, she said, great, you've come to join the picket, have you, Mark? I said, no, I've come to see the film. I said, I, <laughs> I said I'm absolutely fascinated. I, and I, I disappointed her greatly with that. The film's based on a book by Nikos Kazantzakis, a Greek book which has been translated into English. And the character of Mary Magdalene in this film is played by Barbara Hershey. And there are several scenes, they're, they're, they're not quite pornographic, but they're not even really soft pornography, but they are verging on it. And it's quite clear that Scorsese is using the scenes, especially earlier in the film, where Mary Magdalene is seen in the brothel. He's using them to titillate the viewer to some extent. And Jesus himself goes and visits Mary Magdalene in the brothel and sees her with various of the people who visit. And she's somewhat horrified when she realizes that Jesus knows what she does. And we hear her story, which is a story that has been part of mainstream Western Christian culture for years, less so in the East, but mainstream Western culture that sees Mary Magdalene as an absolutely key uh, figure because of her nature as a reformed prostitute. Now, the really key bit in the film, the really key scene, occurs when Jesus is on the cross. This is the last temptation of the title of the film. What happens is when Jesus is on the cross, he has a hallucination in which a young girl appears to him and persuades him to come down from the cross and imagine what his life would have been like if he wasn't crucified and if he hadn't died. In the book, he's described as a young Arab boy, but Scorsese changed it to a young British girl. <laughs> I, actually, I actually looked her up. She, she is now a dance instructor in London. She, um, she did a little bit of child acting and now she's a dance instructor in London. Uh, it's a brilliant performance, utterly compelling. And what she does is she walks Jesus through his life, the kind of life that he would have had if he didn't get crucified on the cross. And you probably can't see that picture ever so well, but this is a close-up of the controversial scene in the film, in which Jesus imagines himself having sex with Mary Magdalene. It's reasonably tastefully done, but nevertheless, it is absolutely unmistakable that they are having sex. And in order to get this um, still, I did actually have to watch the scene several times. <laughs> and <laughs> and um, it's proved a little bit difficult because I share, when I'm working at home, I share an office with my wife and um, she could hear that I was, I, I was watching something which was obviously a little racy, shall we say. And I appeared to be watching this repeated times, rewinding it and trying to find the still. And she said, what on earth are you doing over there? And I said, don't worry, I'm just doing some research. Just <laughs> 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 but um, so you have the scene in which Jesus, played by Willem Dafoe, is seen having sex with Mary Magdalene. She gets pregnant and gives birth to a child. Later in the same scene, uh, Mary Magdalene dies and Jesus goes through that trauma and he remarries uh, Mary out of Mary and Martha. And it's, it's an extraordinary scene. As you go through the scene, eventually Jesus comes through the other side of the temptation and he announces on the cross, it is finished. And he realizes that he has overcome the temptation and he decides to die. And the moment the film finishes is the moment where Jesus has decide that, decided that he will die. So this was quite a controversial film, and it was controversial because it depicted Jesus having sex with Mary Magdalene. It was not controversial because it depicted Mary Magdalene as a prostitute, because Mary Magdalene as a prostitute had been the re received wisdom for many, many years in Christianity. 